The beginning of Earth was a fiery and dangerous one. The air was so toxic that if one were to go back in time, they'd be dead in an instant. Even in a revolution where life was beginning to take form, there was only so much of it to give. Still, life was relentless, and its love was what pulled it through the fire. Though times were certainly still difficult, love rendered the harshness of the world nearly powerless. But only nearly. Despite life's endeavors to grow stronger, when rain becomes fire, death proves itself the one in control. I'll need to leave for the train station soon to pick up the girls. I still can't comprehend why I was rated best for their caretaker. I don't think I could ever get used to them calling me Aunt Susie, especially Taylor. Perhaps this will be good for all of us in the long run. But facts won't change their perception of reality here. If they're going to live here, they need to feel as if their past trauma never existed. A fresh start, if you will. Fortunately, thanks to the email I was sent regarding their behaviors and interests, and now that I have clearance for my manager, I can begin work on Project Black and White. I think the girls will love what's in store for them this Christmas. Ha! Beat you downstairs. It wasn't even a race. Good morning, Aunt Susie. Do you like the cookies we made for you? <laughs> yes, I do like these cookies. If you're awake, we can go downstairs and see your Christmas gifts. I'm sure they'll be delighted to see you. They? Now, I was only able to give one of them the ability to speak since, as far as research goes, only one of them has an official voice. I'm honestly not certain if I've got it right. If not, Nikki, I hope you forgive me. For what? Take a look for yourself. I was right. The girls loved Bendy and Papyrus, and I'm very pleased with the way today has gone. It's quite convenient, actually. Now the girls will never have to lie awake at night thinking of their past. They'll have their new friends as a reminder that they're not alone anymore. They'll never have to be alone ever again. Yes? Thanks for the new buddies. Of course. Good night, Taylor. Good night, Aunt Susie. And so, Earth grew stronger than before. Certainly, the world remained harsh and unforgiving. But greater numbers and greater love resulted in greater strength, and mighty life overpowered the tragedy of death. <laughs>